Trial Hush. Recording equipment is running. We'll want to review the data when we're done. Grab the Capri Sun. Scoop Great. them over Let's here. He's gonna moonwalk over here for some reason. I'm up. Cancel at 60. At 60, we're done here. Okay. Or close to 60 at least. Try to keep them together. Try to keep them like around this spot, like on the side. That way you can hit them both. 925, we're gonna use our skill. We wanna keep them together so we can hit both at the same time. Scoop them up. Oop. Okay. I was a little delayed, but sure. A little slow, but at least we can hit both at the same time now. Now they're close by to the pillar, and we can hit the pillar. That's a lot of damage. Okay. Great. Why don't these guns auto load? All right. All right, we're gonna keep them over here. Raise the pressure. Push up against this wall. There we go. Now we just have to do one more ultimate and we'll be good to go. I'm kind of tired. Need them both to kind of be together here though. Oh, okay. That's not what I wanted to do, but okay. Guess we'll go off that. This one we're gonna do the full amount. Oh, hey, we did it! <laughs> there we go. That's, my 10, That's how you get uh, a clear with solo trial freesia. All right, not 4,000 points. Came close though. But you'll come close to 4,000 if you do it that way. Probably better than I did. But the most important thing to take away is when you get the first ult, you want to scoop them together. You want to use the ultimate, and then you want to cancel it at 60 charge. And then after that, once you stop it, you want to just keep shooting them to build up more charge so you can shoot the pillar afterwards. So when the pillar comes online, you want to scoop them together and get them close to the pillar and then use the ultimate and kind of like thread the needle a bit. You want to like shoot the laser so it's touching the pillar, but also touching the enemies at the same time. With Freesia Hush's ability, you're able to kind of have a little bit more control with that power and just keep them together. So that's what you're going to do on the first laser on the pillar. Once that's over, you're gonna do another full laser. You're gonna grab the next juice box, get the ultimate charge, scoop them back up again and use the full mount. And then after that one, you use the final ultimate on the pillar again at the very end. And it, it would help again at the very end if you can scoop them up and get them close to the pillar one more time to try to hit both at the same time, but it's not really mandatory on the last one. But if you do, you probably get a higher score than I did. On top of that though, if you do, this is with Solo Freesia right here, right here, Solo Freesia. So keep in mind, if you have Zhanji on your team, that's gonna give Freesia more ult charge because Zhanji will increase the maximum capacity of ult that you can hold and Trial Hush can use a higher amount of ult charge to do more damage. So actually, despite how I did it with just the Solo, uh, solo Freesia here, you'll be able to get way more mileage if just one of your characters on the team has this logistics, the Shanshi squad, to increase her ultimate regeneration and give her a higher cap. So using that strategy on top of the Shanshi squad, you'll definitely get way higher than 4,000 points. And along with that, you can use that strategy with each difficulty, probably not difficulty one if you can already get enough DPS, but if you do all of that, you should get enough points to get this border at 35,000 points. By the way, in addition to that uh, Blitz guide, I want to show you all that I'm on my free-to-play account here. And I did nothing but use trial characters using the strategies and techniques that we've developed since this mode has came out. So using all these strategies and these guides or whatever, I was actually able to get to thir almost 3,400 points, right? But we still have two more days to collect the this currency here in order to do more. So... I'm at about 3,400 and all I have to do is just complete this, these encampments right here, these two encampments. So that would be 300 points. This will be 600 points. 
And then at level one, I'll collect this one for for a total of 800. This will bump me up to 1,000. This will bump me up to 1,200. And this will bump me up to 1,400. And that will put me a little bit over the 3,500 mark. And that will allow me to get the frame, not even completely free to play, but completely with trial characters only. So trial, by the way. So if you just follow along and just do your best with just the trial characters alone, of course, if you bring your own characters in addition to these trial characters, you will do just as well. Okay. I just want you guys to keep that in mind on top of like, you know, bringing Zhangji for free shit on the blitz, you know, you guys can do it. So let me know how you guys are handling this game mode in the comments. How are you liking Shroud City? Let me know if there's any questions I can help out with. Just ask away and we'll all be in the summer vacation very soon. <laughs> all right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. You all take care.